your boy Davidoff. On your screen is the squad for Aberdeen away in Europa League group stage. Uh, by the way, I recorded this straight after the first episode, so same situation. No live commentary, voiceover commentary again today. And for the fifth game, my video corrupted because my laptop stopped working mid-recording. Which is really annoying because there was 20 minutes left in the game, in game time. But yeah, against Juventus as well. We were winning 3-0 and we won 3-0. At least I didn't at least I didn't lose the gameplay, but um I had to use backup footage that looks really bad. Straight off PlayStation 720p footage. Which should be good, but it doesn't it doesn't look great. You you'll see it, you'll see it soon. At the it's in the last game of this episode. So yeah, anyway, on to the games. You just saw the first goal from our number 14, Gab. 1-0 against Aberdeen away. Uh, good start so far uh, from a free kick. I'm pretty sure from Shayan. Shayan there to Tyler Rose. Oh, couldn't get it there. As you can see, the passing is just not all there at the moment. Sent to end at the moment, but still not great passing from either team. But Aberdeen have a chance here, and it's well, it's just about, uh, just about uh, palmed away by the keeper. Tyler Rose hits the post as well. So unlucky. Europa League tends to be a bit like a bit a bit tighter. Than uh, league games, which is good. I want tighter games and a couple good saves there. Can we score here? Nope. Another good save. Whoever this keeper is, he's very good in in this game. Aaron Reed, bang! There you go. That is how you make it comfortable. So yeah, yet again, Aaron scores. Yet again, off to a good start and a good game so far. Still like still two 0 though. Um, doing well. Daniel, who is on the pitch, of course, because he plays. He starts in Europa League. Played to the Tyler Rose. What can we do? Oh, that's a good save. That is a very, very good save. Their keeper's good. Whoever this is, it's a good keeper. Shayan to Aaron. Aaron is on fire for us, and look at that. Look at that. That deserves a replay. That is absolutely brilliant. He's a top scorer. He's he, for a cam. He is amazing at goal scoring. He's absolutely brilliant. Just look at this. Just look at this. How do you stop him? How do you stop him? Another free kick here, similar to the first half, and Cheyenne yet again hit the bar. Two two times hit the bar of a free kick in this game, which is flipping crazy. But there you go. There are 20 minutes to go in this game, and well, that's some good defending there. Can we counter though? Well, it's cleared away. No counter. Aberdeen have brought it back in, and it's won again by Aaron, all the way back there. He can do it all. Cheyenne to Tyler Rose. We, have, we actually have a counter now. Out wide to Gab. Is he going to pass it back to Tyler Rose? Yes, he is. Tyler Rose cuts in. Finesse. Oh, not far off. Aaron's there, though. Bang. It's saved. Danielle was there. Crosses it in to Aaron. Nope. Kieran. Nope. Gab scores. That was a scramble. That was lucky. But there you go. And there's Tyler Rose's yellow card, by the way. That's our first yellow card as a team. Anyway. Got manager in month yet again, got in October as well, so three months in a row. That is uh, pretty impressive. This is a big game now against Roma. Next after Roma, we got into Milan, and then we're playing Juventus as well. So, And we got Europa League too, so got some big games in this episode. There you go. Aaron, yet again, scores the first goal early again. He is on... How? He's so good. He's so good. At this rate... Danielle's never going to start in the league because Aaron is just on fire. Literally. Not literally, but he is on fire. And well, Rome had a chance there. Bit of a scare there. Uh, good attack there. Stopped by use of Wakar. Shade now on the ball to Rory. Rory, can he score? Yes, he can. 2 0 to Milan. It's still not even 20 minutes gone on the clock. So now we have Aaron on the ball, crosses it in. What can he do? Okay, it's cleared away, but Adrian is there. That is Tony Kroos esque. That is a brilliant finish. I have seen Tony Kroos do that so many times, and he's done that himself. Absolutely brilliant. Danielle's on now, makes some subs, you know, got rest some players. Tyler Rose playing left wing today, just for today. Kieran coming on too. So yeah, 3 0 up very comfortable and we brought some subs on to give him game time of course because everyone needs to play otherwise it's not very fair for the people who watch anyway Danielle there you go nice and simple that was one touch football at its best that was a brilliant team goal 
absolutely brilliant. Anyway, just past the hour mark, can we get another? Danielle's on the ball, passes to Rory. Rory puts in Tyler Rose on the left wing. The two strikers play together for the first time in competition. Oh, what a save though. What a save. And that was Yusuf's shot as well. A brilliant save yet again. Tyler Rose sees overlapping Kieran. Kieran is there. Kieran Gamble. Here he is. Is he going to cross it? He's caught in quite far. He's crossed it. And nothing's come of that. But we did get a corner. And it was saved. And somehow that was blocked as well. Brilliant defending from Roma. They're 4-0 down. But they've still got some resilience in there. Which is good. Which is good. Good to know they're not giving up. But they're not winning this game clearly. But still. They still have determination to stop our shots. Anyway, Sammy forced to save there too. A cross came in, couldn't score, but finally, finally, Kieran McIntosh finished it off to make it 5 0. We were already comfortable, already finished the game off, and there you go game, set, and match. And as you can see on the screen, up next is the Milan Derby. This is a massive game in Italy. It used to be a lot bigger, of course, because it used to be about the title, but. It's still a massive game, great rivalry, big derby. Can we win it though? That was a deflected shot and it was saved unfortunately for us. But we're on the attack and it's saved again. Can we score? We need to score because Inter Milan, they look good. This is one of our toughest games this season so far. Kieran won the ball there of course, started this attack, a potential attack rather. But can we score from it? Rory's on the ball. He's turned his man. There you go, Aaron Reed. nope, can't get to him. Probably should have come forward towards the ball. A bit of a mistake there, but never mind. Gab into Aaron, he shoots. There you go. Our mega star. I don't mention Gab enough either. Like, Gab gets a lot of assists for Aaron's goals, so he deserves credit too. We have a lot of stars on that team. Look at that, hitting the bar. So unlucky. Gab forcing a save and Yusuf you're meant to be Prime Cafu, what was that? Anyway, that was Aaron's shot there, but it's not his goal. He is celebrating, but it did go down as an own goal, unfortunately. Uh, some subs coming on now. Daniel at left wing. Shane coming on in DM, just for now. And Brusk at centre-back. So yeah, Shane, ah, that, that could have gone in. It was close though, it was a good shot. Should have gone in though. There you go, forced to save. And Daniel, that is, that, that is a sitter. You've got to score that, Daniel. That's absolutely unbelievable, that miss. Anyway, Daniel out wide. Can you redeem yourself? Good cross. Shayan scores. I think that's his first goal. I think that's his first goal. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think that's his first goal. Shayan has done brilliantly to make it 3-0 to Milan. Absolutely brilliant. That was great teamwork as well. We scored a lot of good teamwork and goals, which is great. And look at that. Kieran McIntosh in the Europa League made it 1-0 starting of course he doesn't usually start in the league but in the Europa League he has the opportunity and he took full advantage because that was a brilliant goal as you can see it, it deserves a replay I mean that was top corner that was top bins top bins anyway Daniel got taken down and he won the penalty but he didn't take it Kieran took it scoring his first goal for the club and that is Milan 2 and I don't know who have we who have we been playing I, I don't even know I'm sorry this is bad commentary commentator should know anyway Tyler Rose is coming on Danielle moving to right wing Aaron is on and Sammy is on so yeah uh, some good subs there oh almost a goal there a save but on the rebound we do score brilliant play Nice goal. Now this is the low quality game. I, you see how bad it is? There's meant to be 720p and it still looks bad. But yeah, that was Aaron again. Scoring another early goal. He is a real star. Uh, I'm just showing you the games because, let's be honest, this, this I'm just showing you the goals, sorry. Because let's be honest, this uh, gameplay, it, it looks horrid right now. It looks, it looks really bad. So let's hurry it up. Look at that, look at that play. Great play from Kieran, Aaron and Gab. Brilliant team play. One of, one of our best goals this season. It's got a lot of good team goals. That was a good header by the way by Yusuf. And I simmed a few games. We won the Europa League. This is the actual Milan team by the way I simmed with. We won the Europa League, won a league game. Won a second Europa League game which puts us top of the group. And we lost to Torino. Now we've got a five point lead 
over Napoli and we got Napoli away next so that's in the next episode haven't played it at this point when I'm recording this episode so um, hopefully live commentary by then hopefully I got it sorted so yeah this is your boy Davidoff please like share subscribe thanks for watching have a good day and see ya